Welcome back viewers you are watching a soft demo a project controls and engineering software academy today i am going to discuss with you about how to change your working days calendar or how to show your calendar days in your wbs of primavera p6 or how to show your calendar days in primavera p6 Mostly clients ask you about why you don't show your contract duration on your top of the schedule. So mostly in Primavera P6, why the Primavera P6 based on calendar days, why it's based on working days, there is the question raised by client. Primavera P6 is based on working days. Why the working days? Because we assign the calendar and we just off for the public holidays and for the weekends. So if we include the weekend in our schedule, so the start date and finish date will be wrong so primavera p6 is more precise to show its data so where are your holidays where are your public holidays it will not display so it's the standard to use the working days in primavera p6 but the client want to know what where you show your contract duration but this 261 days are not my contract duration these are my working duration or working days duration so he don't want to see this one so what we will do without changing my other data here but without changing my dates below how can i display here in original duration my another duration or any contract duration there is a small trick you can use that one i have explored so i will show my calendar here by go in the column and we will find out my calendar and from calendar i will see which calendar i have assigned mostly i used to assign project calendar so may i have different projects so i will assign different project calendar to different project i do not need to assign a global calendar because sometimes why when i export or import project in another database so i need to know which project calendar i have assigned so there are different calendars for different project in different so different oceans there are different time of uh, working days there are different uh, locations and there are different public holidays so in this project i have assigned epe calendar so that are five working days attend 10 work 10 hour per day so, so we will go here in the enterprise and in calendar we will see our project calendar what is our project calendar we will go modify we will see eight hour a day and in work week we will see there are two days off and there are also public holidays so where are my clients comments so i have just taken a small screenshot i don't don't want to show all my comments of my client or consultant so there are no not related to you so in this video i will just explain what he want to say so what he want to say that adjust project duration from commencement throughout substantial completion to 365 days calendar days so he want to see that 365 days after the commencement after the commencement he want to see 365 days here but if we change the calendar hold the calendar to calendar days and we will not display working days there will be a big mess our all the planned budget units and our all the planned duration will be wrong it will be wrong displayed and there will be off day or there will be a public holiday or there is a weekend so there will be a work shown or an activity finishing or an activity starting so totally wrong wrong uh, critical path and totally wrong start and finish date so if we go or global when we click on the global you will see another calendar i have already created the calendar 7 into 10 we will work for one week and 7 into 10 modify modify with work week and all the weeks of 10 10 days 10 10 hours in a day so 7 week work so there is throughout work in a week i will press okay so this calendar is ready to assign this project so there are 261 days already in original duration showing we need to show 365 days here so also you can see the activities other activities have a duration also we don't need to change them so you will see that one i will go here in the projects and in the defaults if haven't assigned default go into customized project so there will be shown in the available tabs you will just drag there press okay i will go in the defaults i will go and select this one 7 into 10 when you will assign 7 into 10 and go in the activities you will see here 
in the top 365 days no finish date changes nothing you, you can see here no calendar changes here the calendar have been assigned the same only on the wbs level your all your all the duration are according to your seven seven days work and that seven days work are your calendar days so if your client is saying that your duration should be according to your contract like this client is saying that uh, we don't need a uh, working days we need a calendar days and it should be shown 365 days so these guys just get confused that why it's showing 261 if you don't want to see that one again so if you want to see the previous one you just just go here and assign the same which have been already assigned here so you can go here same or you can just change any other calendar from here so it will be displayed same so at wbs level only the defaults calendar will be shown the calendar which have been assigned here will be shown at your wbs level so do not forget at wbs level this calendar will be not effective which is in activities so it will be not affected at your wbs level at any cost so this is our today's content how to how to show your calendar days in the wbs in a project so how it is possible to show your contract duration thanks for watching softy demi our whatsapp number have been given in the end of the video also our website you can visit our website for more courses www.softydemi.com don't forget to visit or contact with us in case of any complication or if you need any video any new video or any content which you are in confused so we will contact with us we will help you out thanks for watching softy demi we will meet in the next a good video